accused of molesting nearly two dozen girls and women in Bangladesh, along with a girl in Allendale, will not face trial. An Ottawa County judge has found Dr. Don Ketchum is not competent to stand trial, which means the case against him will be dismissed. 24 Hour News 8's Ken Colker has followed this case for years. He's joining us in studio with more on the judge's ruling. Ken? Marlene Bryant, after a hearing earlier this month, the judge ruled that Ketchum, who is now 87, is incompetent to help in his own defense, in part because he suffers from Parkinson's disease and memory loss. Ketchum's alleged victims in Bangladesh, once known as MKs, or missionary kids, say this was their only chance for justice. They didn't get it in Bangladesh, or when they returned to the States. As far as earthly justice, yeah, this was our one shot. A report by Ketchum's former missionary group determined that he molested 18 girls and five young women on the mission field in Bangladesh, most under the guise of medicine. Most of the victims were children of missionaries. They say it happened in the 1960s, 70s, and 80s. Diana Durrell and her sister were among the alleged victims, but there were no charges. He's been able to dodge accountability uh, and responsibility for a very long time. The missionary group covered it up even after Ketchum admitted to quote-unquote perverted sin with Diana's little sister, starting when she was 12. He was in his 50s. After being forced to leave the mission field in 1989, Ketchum started practicing medicine in Allendale. That's where he allegedly molested a girl about four or five in 1999, also under the guise of medicine, while her mom was in the room. She first told the Ottawa County Sheriff's Department in 2011, but the case went nowhere until it was reopened in response to a targeted investigation. Hi, Dr. Ketchum. Ketchum was ordered to stand trial, and some of his alleged victims from Bangladesh were expected to testify. I think it was one of those things that we dreaded, but were willing to do if that's what it took. But now, that won't happen. An Ottawa County Circuit Judge issued a written opinion saying Ketchum is not capable of helping himself in court, citing his age, failing health, and fading memory. I hope that young gal knows that even though he got off that we all believe, you know, we believe her. In light of what we, be at least what I believe about God, his ultimate judgment is still coming and justice, he'll still face the ultimate judge. We spoke to the prosecutor on the case who says he was disappointed with the ruling but does not expect to appeal. We also reached out to the woman who filed the local complaint but were not able to reach her.